Hey everybody, welcome back. Oh God, I forgot how horrible the background looks in this area for some reason. So, uh, between episodes, all I did was check to make sure that the day and the chapter and everything was right, and I came to Anna's tree, Anna's forest, whatever it was called. We're gonna smoke here until Carol shows up and just see if we can do that Carol quest already. But there's a uh, very little side questing left in the game. I started counting the side quests. There's very little left. Uh, we have 12 quests left, but like two are show cards to, to uh, Wesley. Two are uh, drive Sigourney around. The Carol quest is two quests in one. Like, because a lot of quests, multiple quests will get done in the same quest line. So it's not really separate quests. So we're almost done every side quest. We have very few left to do. So we're just gonna smoke here and pretty much every hour we'll, uh... Okay, that's about an hour from where we started and we're just gonna tab out and see, is she here? No, it's still just Isaac and Jim and Isaiah. I don't even know where she is right now, but it says that Carol can show up on clear days in the morning, uh -huh. or no, it was early afternoon, I think is how they worded it, but I'm not entirely sure that that's correct. So I'm just checking every hour. Early <laughs> afternoon would be around like one or two. Yeah, but that's the thing is this game's bad about descriptors of quests. So I'm just checking every hour because I don't care if I burn through cigarettes anymore because we make so much money now that I'm not concerned. I got to go back in. Also, our guy's getting hungry. Uh, I don't need cookies for anything, so we'll eat one. I only, yeah, I can eat an onion and I'll eat a cherry pie. <laughs> Ew. Uh, cigarette. We may as well have infinite uh, money at this point. Uh, oh, right, and then like, what are the other quests even left? There's like a trivia one. There's two spiritual map ones we can do later. There's that Diana Ames, Ames one that says we can do this chapter, but we totally can't. All right, where is she right now? Carol is at the a and Diner right now. I swear to God, is she just gonna live there for this entire chapter? I think she is. I think the game is just fucking lying again about when <laughs> things are available. <laughs> okay, so she's also available chapter 11. And is this one available chapter 11? It is not for fuck's sake. <laughs> chapter 11 is the next time that we want to do a lot of side quests because it's one of our last chances to do an Emily quest. You know what? That's fine. We can do that chapter 11. I'm gonna smoke two more times, and if she doesn't show up, then we'll just go on with the main story until chapter 11. 11? Uh -huh. Yeah, 11. Either than that, I don't think there's any other quests we really need to do this chapter. Yep, is she at the main quest still? She is, she is clearly not leaving that diner. Uh, once again, the menu saying uh, what chapters you can do quests on has fucked us. Okay. So, uh, other quests we can do right now. We're chapter nine, so it's just the Diane Ames quest. And can't do the Emily quest yet. And Sigourney. Uh, where is Sigourney right now? I don't know. I uh, Last time she was at the graveyard, but she was always at just like a random place. Roaming Sigourney is outside of the Mercury Theater right now. She doesn't have a quest icon, but I don't trust it, so I'm going to go there and check manually, just in case. Failing that, ANG Diner will go on with the main story. Uh, community center. Is she gonna let us do a quest? Because I'd like to get it out of the way early. All right, what have we got? Is she gonna give us our quest? She should be in the parking lot. There she is. I don't see a quest marker. Hey, watch out, my plot's not in a good mood today. Okay. All right, so it is actually you already, that one. I think it's because you already recently um, <clears throat> did a quest for her. I think we actually did that twice in this uh, chapter, 
but I don't know if there was a 24 hour break because I think the last time we did it in the late afternoon. Doesn't matter, we get a thousand chances to do these Sigourney quests. Let's just go on with ANG Diner then and we will, uh, we will do the next main story thing then. And in chapter 11, we do some of the last side questing of the game actually. There's not a whole lot after, oh my God, I'm blind. Oh no, we're good. No, never mind. My eyes were just closed. Oh. <laughs> Emily, were you waiting outside for me? Should I have gone inside and started the 20 questions? Is it male or female? Would have been fine with me. Shall we get something to eat then? Someone should teach you how to be more considerate. And now you want something to eat? I thought we were going to question Nick. Not going to hold the door for her. <laughs> Someone should teach you to be more considerate. Welcome, Mr. Agent. Hi, Olivia. Let me have your special for today. And some fresh coffee. Our special today is turkey. A turkey and gravy sandwich. Sound good? That sounds Perfect. good. Emily, you eat something, too. It'll be on the FBI. Okay, then. I'll go all out. I'll have the Murder by bad food, that is. That, so that'll be on the FBI. It because it's a little too expensive. <laughs> Mrs. Olivia Cormack, mm -hmm. I am here for Mr. Stewart's lunch. <laughs> if it is ready, I thank you a bunch. Yes, of course. Just a moment. I love this cutscene. This is one of the more famous cutscenes of the game. The usual. One turkey, strawberry jam, and cereal sandwich. Sounds like the sinner's sandwich. Self-inflicted punishment to atone for past sins. He's setting an example. Mr. Francis York Morgan, you should try this wonderful lunch. It's more than a delicious, tasty crunch. So says Mr. Stewart. No, that's fine. I've just ordered my own lunch. Mr. Francis York Morgan, I, that is, Mr. Stewart's order is delicious, I should mention. And Mr. Nick Cormack is a genius for creating this perfection. So says Mr. Stewart. Still, I have a hunch I might not like it. Are you sure that sandwich is that good? Are you sure Mario Sunshine is a good game? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Francis York Morgan, making decisions based on intuitions is always a sign of bad FBI agents. So says Mr. Stewart. Assassin us. Harry, you're right. I'll give it a try. <laughs> it looks so weird. Hmm? Oh, I can't believe it. This is fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> What's with the skateboarder music? I know. Olivia, I'm sorry, but can I change my order? I'll have what Harry is having. Oh, it's so goofy. Nick and Diane. They hardly make the perfect couple, do they? Is it widely known that they go drinking together, just the two of them? To be honest, I don't pay attention to these things. Not into local gossip? Well, when I moved here, I was still in high school and I kept wearing the same wild clothes from my school in Seattle. I was young back then. And before I knew it, there were rumors all over the school. Wait, you were? She'll screw anyone. That's what they said. Totally unfounded, of course. Anyway, after that, I just sort of chose not to really trust gossip. Emily, should you be having a beer at like nine in the morning or something? I get where you're coming from. It's five o'clock somewhere. I used to dress like a hardcore punk rocker when I was in high school. <laughs> <laughs> Shh, it's 
sudden Me? music shift. <laughs> Got my thumbnail. Nobody took my side. Even when I had good grades, people rejected me just because of what I wore. I was young back then, too. <laughs> Even still, I just don't see you as a punk rocker. <laughs> and you laugh? Look at you. No makeup on, dressed in uniform, eating a steak for lunch. Okay, back to work. Let's talk to Nick. She's fallen for him. You can see in her distant gaze that's <laughs> not at him. I'm sorry, what about the distant day? Is what about the distant gaze? <laughs> um, they're very far away, you see. Ah. Uh, so now that and I've done good, that, no. <laughs> now that we've done that <coughs> and it's still Homophobia. chapter nine, does that make Carol fuck the fuck off and go to the park so I can go talk to her there? Or is Carol still in here? No, Carol's just inexplicably in here until you do this quest that has nothing to do with her. Are you fucking kidding me? If I go outside right now and I check the out- God damn it! It kept telling me she's in here! Oh, she's not in here. Carol is not in here. I'm not okay with this. Nick, talk to me. What's up? Could you tell us where, what you were doing the night Anna was killed? I was at the bar with Diane. What did you two talk about, Nick? I, I interpreted that as, what did you two talk about, Nick? <laughs> yes. Himself. I was talking about Nick, how did you guess? Rembrandt and Turner, is that a problem? No, no problem. If you think Diane did it, you're wrong. No, that's not it. Oh, so it's me you're after, isn't it? You're wrong again. So much for the FBI, huh? I hate Nick. That isn't the case either, Nick. I think there's something both of you are hiding. A penis. I can t Where are they hiding is the real question. You can tell when people are hiding something by their reactions. I Do you have a penis? What? <laughs> no, 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 Babaka? <laughs> yes, this is now an anime. Eye, tongue, and hand movements. Sweat, dry lips, neck angles, and such. I'm working here. If you aren't ordering anything, get it. We just ate. <sighs> I don't like Nick. If you aren't any ordering anything more, then get out. All right, I'll order some, uh, a piece of bread. I remember last time we were in here, there was someone, some NPC just eating a piece of bread. Anyone? There we go. Oh, that's a good breakfast right there. <laughs> Looks great. Dipping it in your coffee, I think. All right, Olivia, tell me something interesting. There's something I'd like to confirm with you, Olivia, if that's okay. Yes, well... So long as it doesn't take too long. First, what were you and Nick doing on the night of the murder? I was here in the diner. Nick said he was going to the bar for a couple of drinks. Does he go to the bar often? Leaving you to hold up the fort? Y yes He says he enjoys the conversation with Diane. Conversation I is thought they euphemism. went drinking again together that night. Do the three of you ever go drinking together? Well, you see, I I'm really not into art. And your husband is well versed in the arts then, I take it. Oh yes, um, looking at art and talking about it is his way of relaxing. <laughs> People just aren't what they seem. Like a certain someone who was into punk rock 10 years ago. You are absolutely right, Emily. But you can be an art lover and a liar at the same time. So says Mr. Stewart. One more thing, Olivia. You just said that you aren't interested in art. That's right. And... So, how come I bumped into you at the art gallery? Didn't seem like Nick brought you there. You were there alone. I... Well... I like trees, is the thing. That's why I went there. Surely you'd be better off in the forest rather than an art gallery then. 
Uh... I think you went to the gallery not to see trees, but to see Diane, right? Uh... You know Nani? Or perhaps this isn't the right place to ask. M meet me in the backyard. You can get there from the parking lot. I'll wait for you there for an hour after we close up. Excuse me, do you know the directions to the backyard? I like the custom logo on the key. That's great. They close yeah. at 2100. Should we get something to drink and wait? From lunch to dinner time. <laughs> yep. Then they both stare into the camera. <laughs> so weird. Contra ham. So, uh, I'll, I'll tell you after the cutscene. There's a common glitch hey, here. York, what do we do now? I want to hear what Olivia has to say. Let's kill time until the diner closes. Okay, then I'm going to make a trip back to the department. I'll see you in the backyard later. Okay, sounds good. Oh my. See you later then. Zach, about Olivia. I presume she wants to tell us something about Nick and Diane. Let's hope it's not just something for the gossip poems. All right, so are we chapter 10 now? So there's a common glitch here. Um, you know how, oh, still chapter, chapter nine. nine, okay. You know how uh, I told oh, you before. Carol's not there. Yeah, yeah, I actually need to go check uh, to see if she's where I hope she is. You know how I told you before that you can revisit any chapter at any time that you've previously been in so you can go back and wrap up old side quests, but I told mm -hmm. you there's glitches involved. We currently have in our key items pocket the key to a place that we're only supposed to go to for this quest, which is the key to the backyard of the ANG diner. Um, when you travel to another uh, another chapter, it'll take out key items that are meant to only get you to a place that you're not supposed to go at other points so that it doesn't break the game. And I don't think they fixed this for the PC version, but infamously on the console version, it usually happened with this key. If you travel to another one, they take out the key, but if you then travel back to this chapter, the game doesn't remember to give you the key again, which completely ruins the save file because if you can't get the key, you can't get in that backlog to continue the plot. Oh, that's brutal. So uh, yeah, I don't know if they fixed it for this. And I don't want to test that, which is why I'm trying to get every quest done in the proper chapter, because I don't want to rely on the uh, chapter select menu at all. And I so, accidentally hit F12 and made a screenshot. That's what that noise was. You said it's a very common glitch, <clears throat> uh, as in, does it happen every time? Like, if you go what, back to the chapter the hell? At any Why point. is Carol McLean in Cope's Tunnel? Trying to get run over. I guess. Um, so if you go back to a chapter, is it guaranteed that it will happen? Or are you saying it's a common glitch as in most people will find it? Uh, it's, it's a common glitch in that if you try to Google what the hell's wrong with your game, you'll find many, many, many forum posts online of people who did chapter select there and came back and realized they don't have the key anymore. It's Got it. on the console at least. Every single time you chapter select and this is the newest chapter you were in, you will lose that key and not get it back. Um, and that happened to a lot of people because a lot of people liberally use chapter select to go back and, and do quests. Because if you go back to an old chapter and you do the quest and you save, it'll remember that you did the quest even if you go back to the newest chapter. Um, it is like non-linear in that way and they did a good job of that but the key items will go away and this is one of the two chapters in the game in which the key item that uh, you lose you don't get back and will ruin your save file I don't remember what the other one was but I do remember there is another instance of it also I'm gonna go to Muse's gallery because now that we're still in chapter 9 but we've done a bit of the main plot I wonder if we're allowed to see Diane now because her quest is available this chapter, but we weren't allowed in the room. Presumably, because when we were there, um, when we were there, we had just seen Kaysen in there in the window, and I'm guessing the game doesn't want us to walk in on whatever that conversation is, because that's supposed to be for later. So I'm just wondering if now that I've done a couple bits of the main story, that maybe, uh, which way was it? This way? Yeah, this way. 
Oh, hey, there we go. She's not in that room anymore. If you don't mind me asking, where is he now? <sighs> the fuck? <laughs> this is all ancient history. The woods, the pure little girl. My respect for my father. Mm hmm. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> I've never done this quest. Uh, okay. This conversation's going weird already. I lost all respect for my father when he had a son. Uh, apparently we can't do this quest in many chapters. Did you get a glimpse of that? Look at this. 9, 11, and 12. We gotta do this fast. Diana's yeah. hiding something. Find the painting of the girl in the woods slumbering <laughs> somewhere in the art gallery and give it to her. She may open up to you. Man, I would not have known what to do if I didn't read this. Okay, so we can do this all right now, I guess, because it's within the building. The girl in the woods painting. How do I know which one that is? Oh, Jesus. Do I really need to look at every painting? Or No, not all of them have descriptions. It'll probably have a glowy in front of it, right? Probably. Uh... Oh, Jesus. Okay, the way they worded that, slumbering somewhere in the gallery, makes me think maybe it's in the underground part? Maybe? Uh, you know, like where we found the, the painting of the, the butterflies. Mm-hmm. Maybe. Uh, I'm not 100% confident that... Uh, oh, can I interact with that? It's red. Uh, is the purple fog intentional? Interesting. That's okay. So there doesn't necessarily need to be a glowy thing on the floor in front of it for it to count. So I do need to pay pretty close attention here. Then I'm looking I for thought anything that looked uh, more like the uh, the purple tentacles or the red tentacles that you'd see during those uh, those creepy segments. It does kind of, doesn't it? A foggy mm -hmm. forest, likely an actual view of somewhere in this town. Uh, hi, Diane. Is the purple fog intentional? Yeah. There is a lot of purple associated with the, uh, I guess the other world segments is what the game calls them. There's a lot of, uh, purple imagery in those. It's all red and purple. Like, when when the zombies appear and die, I, I guess they aren't zombies, but you know what I mean. Um, is, is it in here? When the, when the purple zombie things appear and die, there's like a purple fog. This room? I'm looking for humanoid figures, mostly. Uh, or just like anything that looks really big and stands out. Yeah, and An this is- uh, Yeah, that was the red butterflies one though. That was to tip off that it's elsewhere. And that's the one we found in the basement to help find the passcode. Which we never are questioned on, by the way, on how the fuck we got in there. What's in here? Outside. Heaven, it looks like. Yeah, or the the green alien invasion once again. Oh, that's just the backyard. Okay, we don't need to be out there. Hey, I found the backyard. I didn't need directions to that. Uh, I'm kind of feeling like it's probably in the basement. But wasn't there only the one painting down there? Maybe I'm misremembering, though. So that door was locked. We tried it earlier. We've already checked all these rooms, and I don't think it's any of these. I'm just going to walk along them just to see if the observe button pops up at all. And then here, and this is the door that's locked. So I go over here. Okay, so it's this inner cord. They just look almost identical. And I can see the lock, and I will shoot with a flamethrower and see if I melt the lock. Oh, that would have been incredible. All right. There we go. Oh, I'll give them uh, credit. That's really creative. Super, super illegal that the FBI agent is just firing guns in the middle of private property. That's a tiny painting. A painting of a girl alone in the woods. I wonder if the young girl is Diane. Or Anna. Uh. This. Call this a painting? Yes. A bit primitive with poor composition. Hardly the work of a master. But strangely, though, it powerfully exudes a soft, warm feeling. On the back, it says, 
guardian of the art gallery in fresh strokes. So someone added that recently. Guardian of the art gallery. Wouldn't that be Diane? And why is this painting here? Man, I never would have thought to uh, shoot the lock off. Like, that would have taken me forever. Because I bet you I'd be looking for a key to the room forever. Just thinking, you know, maybe I get a key a later chapter or something. All right, enough firing my revolver in the middle of an art gallery. Uh, let's let's find Diane and give this to her. Where is she right now? She's in the front lobby. She does move around the gallery a lot, which is cool, but also more than slightly annoying, just because I kind of need to find her. All right, well, she can't get past me if she's over here. There! Haha, -ha, I found you! Engine York, how may I help you? I don't have a human skull to show you anymore. Uh, but here is, here's your own painting that I stole from your back room. I'd like to ask you about this painting. <laughs> Just shove it in her face. And why do you have this painting? I found it in the gallery. And it struck me as a little strange. Anything. Even the smallest thing can help me with the investigation. I truly doubt this painting would have anything to do with your investigation. On the back it says, Guardian of the Art Gallery. That's you, right? You're wrong, Agent York. That is me in the painting. But the Guardian of the Art Gallery that it refers to is not me. Hmm? This was drawn by my father. He certainly wasn't a talented artist. But I was so happy when he gave me this painting. I used to love this painting so much. I wanted to hang it by the entrance of the gallery so everyone would see it. That way this painting would, in a sense, guard the gallery. But it was locked up in a small room. Not a nice way to treat the guardian. <sighs> no, that'll be it. I didn't Apologies say anything, but okay. And for bringing out this painting. It's okay. It's nice to be able to talk about the past every so often. Here, take this. It's a small gift. Painting of a girl. Hey, we needed more cards. Zach. They say you have to look at the big picture. That was a painting of a little girl that was locked up in a gallery filled with paintings of trees. She'd be Alice if this was Wonderland. Yay! Man, it's weird to think we're almost done all of the side that quests. That musical sting, in a way, also sounds a bit like uh, a punchline sound effect. Yeah, I could see that. All right, uh, we are done here. So next episode, everybody, uh, we will hopefully be starting with finishing the Carol quest now that we're still chapter nine. And that... Fucking, she's, she's out of that one place, so we'll probably just tune back in the next day, already over in the Woods of Anna, trying for that again. Until next time, have a nice day. Those who choose Camry, choose Camry.